Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Shelby, and as you saw by the title of this video, I have an empties. I have my bucket of empties right here, and let's get started. Um, so these are my um, beauties empties, or just random products that um, I used up this month. I just want to share them with you, go through my empty bucket, and yeah. So some fragrance-free um baby wipes I use probably a pack a month um I use them as like to clean off some dust or I also use them in my car and I also use them um to clean the lady regions you know um I've talked about them before and I'll continue to talk about them <laughs> um I also used up this um, fragrance booster from the Method brand. Um, this is Beach Sage, and this is my favorite um, fragrance booster. Um, it's probably the only one that doesn't irritate my skin is this Method brand. Um, so I will continue to purchase that one. Um, right now I'm using, I think like a ginger orange. Um, and I like it, not my favorite, but I like it and I'll continue to use it. Um, then I have uh, two soaps. So I have this um, Vanilla Bean Noel um, from Bath & Body Works. This is the deep cleansing hand soap and it normally is the foaming. So I just finished it up. I actually, as you can see, there's some water in there to try and get the last little bits out. And then I used up the, what is this? Winterberry Ice Foaming um, Hand Soap. And this smelled so good. Um, my sister and I share a bathroom and we both really, really liked it. Um, and so I would highly recommend. The notes are iced cherries, juicy orange, and snowy lime. And I love lime. Um, and so there wasn't a huge amount of lime, but there was just enough. Next I have two of these face masks. These are the clay mask with charcoal detoxifying. I don't know what brand they are. My mom got them for me. Um, it looks like they're Target brand because they're from Target. She got them for me like right after Christmas when all the gimmicky face mask stuff is on sale and it was all right. I'm not really a huge fan of clay masks. I'm actually trying to use up all my clay masks to get rid of them. And so speaking of clay mask, I have the Freeman uh, Purifying Avocado and Oatmeal and Oatmeal Face Mask, uh, Clay Mask. Um, and it is for normal to combo skin. This was all right. It was a clay mask. And like I said, don't really fully enjoy clay masks, but I used up the whole thing. It is empty, empty. Um, yeah, it was all right. It didn't really do much for my skin. Um, it didn't irritate my skin, but it didn't really help it either. Um, next I have this Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthening and Glow Treatment Mask with Shea Butter, Peppermint, and Keratin. Um, Sulfate-free color, safe. Um, yeah, it was a hair mask. <laughs> I was trying to see if there was like anything specific on it. Um, but yeah. I used it up. I had it for a long time, so I figured it was time to use it. Um, it was alright. I probably won't purchase that again. Um, a little thing of travel tissues. Um, I have two pocket bags. I have Cactus Blossom and Many Thinks, which Many Thinks is apricot and apple. Um, finish both these off. I tend to finish off a couple hand sanitizers a month hashtag COVID. Um, next I have a Carmex that I finished off. This is my favorite uh, chapstick. So you'll see it a lot and I will continue to purchase it and have it in these. Then next I have, this is from Bath & Body Works a long time ago, like probably 2010. <laughs> um, so it's probably done expired and gross and I probably should have thrown it away a long time ago. It doesn't look like there's a date on here, but 
This is the Spearmint Mentha Lip Shine. Um, and yeah, I finally used it up. It's the little thing. I don't know if you guys remember these. I don't know if they still sell them, honestly. Um, but yeah, I used this up. Obviously, I wasn't a huge fan because I still have it and it's been... I was in ninth grade in 2009. Uh, so either in 2009 or 2010 is when I bought it. Um, so it's been a while. <laughs> um, next I have one of the Tinkle Face Razors. Buy these off of Amazon. They're great. Um, then I have um, this Vagisil Bath Balm um, Sensitive Scents uh, White Jasmine. This was in a recent haul. Um, this is from Dollar Tree, I believe. One of the dollar stores. I believe it's Dollar Tree. Um, and yeah, I, I liked it. I liked the smell of it. Um, I thought it was nice. Um, they're newer. I will probably purchase more. I have one more in a different scent. Um, but I just haven't used it yet. And then I have my travel toothbrush and my travel toothbrush holder because I I could disinfect the toothbrush holder. But I actually, um, when my sister and I were traveling earlier in the month, I dropped my toothbrush on the floor at my grandparents house like the day we were leaving and I picked it up and I was like this is so gross so I'm just gonna be done with it and I put it back in here not thinking anything about it um so yeah both of these are gonna be done um because I bought a new toothbrush holder and I bought a new travel toothbrush and so uh, because I don't travel often and obviously we're not traveling that much because of COVID It'll last me a long time. <laughs> so, it, honestly, it might last me a couple years. Um, yeah. And then I have two different body washes. This is the Warm Vanilla Sugar Shower Gel. Um, I just needed to use this up, and I figured right now was the perfect time um, to use it up in January. And then I have this Aromatherapy Happiness Bergamot and Mandarin. Um, body wash and foam bath. I used this in the bath and I loved this. This was awesome. Um, I will probably repurchase that one once I use up um, some of the stuff that I have because I, I have a lot of bath stuff that I need to use up and get rid of. Um, I have two different deodorants. This one is the secret uh, little travel one. Um, it is gone. Um, I took this again to Tennessee and, um, it is gone, 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 gone. Um, I like dug it out. Um, and so there's that. Um, I probably won't be repurchasing that, but then again, I might, um, uh, because again, that was a travel one, travel size. It lasted me a long time. And then... My last thing, which is my last deodorant, this is the Nero Myro um, Solar Flare. This is the refill pod. Um, and Solar Flare is orange, juniper, and sunflower. It is a plant powder deodorant. Um, and it comes in um, this is the pod, and you just stick it in the container. Um, and then you just have refills. Um, I do like these deodorants and I will probably be continuing to use um, the Miro, Miro, whatever this brand is. Um, at first I did not like them uh, because they were using a weird formulation and then they changed their formula and this is the new formula and I really, really like it. Um, so yeah, I will probably be repurchasing that because that saves on um, some plastic in the long run. And um, this is recyclable. So I will be recycling that, which most of this I do recycle. Um, 
so it doesn't just all get tossed in the landfill um so yeah I like to save it up and recycle it all at once um so that's my empties <laughs> this is a lot longer than I thought um I just filmed and uploaded my um home fragrance empties so go check that video out and yeah I will see you guys soon um and I do post these once a month um occasionally I will wait an extra month just because maybe I didn't use um much stuff but generally I post this once a month and then my home fragrance empties once a month um so check those out I have a playlist um this is connected to the playlist of empties um and yeah I will see you guys soon Peace.